Hey guys, today I'm going to be unboxing the Emosi portable laptop charger. It's a power bank and it uh, has 116 watt hours and it supposedly can charge a 100 watt travel notebook charger. So, um, I'll see what it looks like, see how it runs, and they specifically say um, it's good for HP, Dell, Lenovo, and MacBook, but we'll see. I'll get my assistant out here, help me out here, my assistant, open this box up. Okay. Again, with this weird packaging, I don't like how the box can just move all around. Like, what kind of packaging is this? Do not like that. Okay. Right. Get the front of this here. It says on the front, inverter power supply. It's pretty small, and it's, it's not heavy. So... I'm not guys, I'm not gonna have this as a use every day for power in my laptop. That's impossible. You can tell by the size. But these are all the specs right here. I'm gonna get that in the shot good. Max power a hundred watt. And it shows you as the input micro USB 5 volt twin. It got a Type C 5 volt 3 amp output USB. So you got all the information right there. And then this is the front face of it. The USB 2.0 regular Type C micro USB for power. Power button. That's the flashlight right here. And here's the get this off the regular outlet plug right here now guys I just got this out the box so it is not fully charged so and in the back it has a little fan a fan area hopefully nothing happened to it in, in shipping because it had basically no protection in there but when I get and it is at about 60%. I just turned it on right here. Hopefully you guys can see that in the shot here. 60% power. Let's see. Let me grab something here and plug it in. I have one of my batteries for my Dremel. I'm going to plug that into this bad boy. See what happens. See if it even registers a reading off of it. All right, it's activated. You guys can hear it. There's the fan in the back kicking in. And you can see the light on this blinking. I just wanted to try a regular outlet device on this but it's not fully charged guys so I didn't expect a lot so now let me get plug that out plug in my USB reader here so you guys can see the reading on here the output this is a USB output guys this is not the complete voltage this is what's coming out of the USB socket it's plugged into okay so be very specific on here this is the USB output that's coming out of the USB All right. I'm 
Let me plug in my little battery here. And you can see the light came on. You guys can see that. So it's not fully charged, so it just turned off. Turn it back on here. All right. Now you can see the light here. It's getting power to the battery. Okay, guys. So let's check what comes in this little uh, box here. You get USB 2.0 to micro USB connection, and then you get a USB 2.0 to Type C connection cable, and you get a little wall plug here. So you basically to charge the device here. Then you get the amazing instruction manual. Help you to understand about your new equipment. Okay? So that's all you get in there in this little box. That's all it comes with. I'm going to see if this can power uh, a radio. I'm going to plug a radio on this and see how much power it has. It only has 60% juice in it, but I'm going to attempt to run a radio off of it. See what happens. Because it says that it can like, hold a, a laptop going so you can save your file. This basic, it's not a backup generator, but we'll see how strong it is. Okay, found an old radio real quick here. Turn this bad boy back on. Uh, I believe a four, four watt radio. Let me double check here. Yeah, this radio is four watts. So, not very powerful, but you can see that it powers the radio. So, let me turn that off for now. I don't want to get copyright strikes on my video. And the only thing, it's pretty loud when you turn it on. Get this little fan back here. I don't like that. But other than that, it's a cool little device. You know, for emergencies, I got this because I live in Florida, so it's for emergency purposes, you know. Most of the time, I'm probably going to use this for, like I just plugged it into my radio. I'll plug my radio in or I'll plug my, um, my phone in. Or if I have another, ba um, another battery pack or any little USB device I want to um, charge, I'll use this. So it's just, you know, it's going to be for emergency, you know, I'll probably, like your tablet, your phone, little, ra little radio, that doesn't take a lot of power. So, if the emergency kicks in, you can still communicate, so that's what this is going to be used for, so. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this was helpful to you, informative, it helped you out somehow. And thank you for checking the channel, thank you for watching the video. Bye-bye.